Welcome to City Grill. My name's Rob Bohr. In this episode, I'm going to do something really fun, uh, a bacon wrap shrimp. And there's lots of different ways you can do this. You know, I, I, to make it really simple, you can clean your shrimp, devein it like I've already done here, and, and just wrap bacon around it. I'd highly recommend pre-cooking the bacon, and I'll show you that here in just a little bit. But you could just wrap the shrimp in the bacon and that's it. In this case, I'm going to do a little kind of marinade seasoning to this shrimp where I'm going to take some melted butter, stick it in here like that, along with some Worcestershire and lemon juice, just like so. And then some uh, nice spices here. I got a little bit of cumin, cayenne uh, pepper, as well as onion and garlic powder. And just put that in just like so. And just stir, mix this up. And then what I'm going to do is place the shrimp in here and let it marinate for at least an hour. Uh, it might be a, a couple hours. You could leave it overnight, but you know, just, just a few hours is gonna be good enough. So I'll just go ahead and place the shrimp in like this, and then mix this well in with the shrimp itself. I'll cover it up and uh, stick it in the refrigerator, you know, keep it cool. And then here in a little bit later, I'll uh, go ahead and wrap it in the bacon. All right, uh, the next step is I brought the shrimp out. And with that butter, it, it gels up in here a little bit, but that's fine. It'll melt when we get it out on the grill anyways. Um, and, and again, I gotta mention, this is a, a, the shrimp is from the shrimp guy in Columbia, South Carolina. He has excellent fresh seafood. I'd highly recommend it if, it, if you're in the area. Anyways, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take a shrimp just like this, and this bacon, I've already cooked it for several minutes. It's a thick cut. Uh, and I'm just going to put it around the bacon, or sorry, put it around the shrimp just like so. Grab a toothpick and just skewer it through just like that. Uh, I'm also going to do a little variation where uh, I might take a little basil in some and uh, go ahead and place it in here like that. Wrap it around here. And again, make sure you get the skewer all the way through the bacon and the shrimp with that toothpick. Squeeze it through there. And just set it in like that. I could do some without any bacon at all but uh, with this seasoning but I, I like the seasoning that I have that we did so let me just finish these up and we'll go out on the grill and start cooking. All right we're out on the grill. I have the grill set at about 350 degrees and I'm ready to put this shrimp on bacon wrapped shrimp so we'll just go ahead and I'll just go ahead and place these on here like so. Here's one I actually ran out of bacon so I'm just gonna leave it like that. I'll go ahead and place the rest of these on there. Again, you know, you don't even have to use a seasoning. You could just uh, pre-cook some bacon, get it pliable, wrap it around the shrimp, and cook it just like that. Add salt and pepper, and you're done. Uh, you know, this recipe just adds a little extra flavor, and uh, and some of these have that basil in it. So I just wanted to add some extra punch to the flavor of this shrimp. All right, it's been two minutes. I'm gonna check on the shrimp. They're looking great. I can smell the bacon. I'll go ahead and rotate the, rotate these around just a little bit, make sure, you know, I'm, I'm trying to watch, you know, the bacon gets a little bit crisp, I, that's fine. Uh, I'm really watching the shrimp because we want to make sure it's done all the way through and I can tell by the way it looks, yeah, it's done on one side, so I'll put these all over and go ahead and do the other side and we'll be ready to eat. Alright, it's been another two minutes, Let's check out the shrimp with the bacon wrapped around it. You know, everything's great with bacon. These look beautiful. The shrimp's done. The bacon's done. Oh, that, that's going to be wonderful. I'll go ahead and put these on a plate, take them inside, and can't wait to eat them. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and check out the recipe on citygrillin.com and see you real soon.